Hi, it's Steve Rosenbaum, and I'm super excited to show you how Easy Deals works. But first, let me tell you why this is such an exciting product for me and why every local marketer should want to get their hands on Easy Deals. You know, I'm a local marketer just like you. And one of my clients once wanted to put up one of these deal specials. They wanted to do something like one of those group coupon type deals, right? And I said, I said, sure, no problem. But when I tried to get it done, I found out it was a much bigger a chore, much bigger task than I thought. I went out and I thought I'd have to hire a web developer, but they wanted a lot of money to do it. Then I started looking at some of the, the page builder programs that are out there that say it's drag and drop simple. But you know what? It's not. There's a big learning curve, and those things are really, really expensive, right? So that's why... I was so excited to get involved with Easy Deals because let me show you how super simple this is. When you log in, this is what the dashboard looks like. And I want you to know, this is really just a matter of three or four steps. And we even give you great looking tutorials. Look, right under here. You're never going to be lost because there's beautiful tutorials that show you exactly what to do each step of the way. It's all right there. But I'll show you what it looks like to put one of these things up. It only takes a second. Let's go back to our dashboard. Let's create a deal. I'm going to do this for my childhood favorite place. I grew up in Northbrook, Illinois, northern suburbs of Chicago, and Little Louie's was the hot dog place where we all went. In fact, I, I blew off lunch every single day in high school, and you could find me at Little Louie's. There's even a picture of me up on the wall there, and it's a very old picture, believe me, right? So as soon as you create the deal, simply give it a name. Look at the beautiful templates we provide you. Dozens and dozens of templates from the most popular categories of all local businesses. You're never going to be lost, uh, you know, and have to start from a clean slate. We've got it all right here. Let's just start with the restaurant for Little Louie's. We open up, you can see a preview, just click on the eyeball. There it is. Look at that. Stunning. Absolutely beautiful. That looks great. We'll choose it, so you just click on the little hand icon right here, and we open it up. Look, if I just press save, I'll let you know that this right out of the bat is ready to go. Look, I could publish it. They're going to give me a link, and this page is live. Watch. I go to the link, and that page is live. Great. But this isn't Little Louie's, right? So I just need to change a few things. The page looks great as it is. We simply go back to the editor. Let's close this up. And... All we have to do is change the elements to make it all about Little Louie's. So obviously we need to put their logo there. I've already uploaded the logo. Super simple to, to do that, right? Just drag and drop. There it is. I'll just click on that. Boom. There it is. Little Louie's right there. Now, Little Louie's a hot dog place. They don't serve chicken. So let's just, let's just click this. And here's a cool thing. I could upload a picture from Little Louie's, but you know what? Let's just say, let's just, just go to Pixabay and say hot dog and fries. Okay, and let's do a search. Oh, look at that right there. Let's just load that up. Look at that. All the information, the alt text is there for SEO purposes. We'll use that image. Bam, gorgeous. Look, if we update it right now, we hit done. Let's go here, refresh our page. Look at that. It's already looking great. How cool is that? All right, let's um, let's change it to text, right? We don't want this lorem epsom test, this text. So let's here, let's just change it up. I just, uh, I wrote this out so you don't have to watch me uh, type. Let's just change the headline and we'll say, hey, get 50% off a hot dog, hand cut fries and a beer. We apply the changes and there it is. Boom. Let's change this Laura Lipsum test uh, text. We'll just grab this and put this here. And Bob's your uncle. There you go. Let's update it. Let's refresh it. Let's see. Look at this real time here in this video. You're seeing how fast it is to put up this deals page. Can you believe how fast that is? And you can you could charge hundreds of dollars for this, right? They don't care how long it takes you to put it up. They just care in the results. The results are they're going to sell a lot more hot dogs because of it. Look how good that page looks. So they're going to be thrilled. It doesn't take you a lot of time. You can even outsource it to a, uh, a VA, right? All right, now look, the deal price, we're not going to charge 100 bucks for uh, a hot dog and fries. What do we do this? Why don't we say we're going to charge 750 750 okay? And the reason why is because, whoops, I, I changed the wrong thing. Hang on a second. This says this was supposed to be deal price. Look at this. You can, change, you can edit anything you want. Deal price, okay? Not 100 bucks. It's actually, we'll say 750 Okay, there you go. The deal value isn't a hundred bucks. It's actually, let's say, fifteen dollars. Okay, there you go. It's a fifty percent discount. Uh, quantity left. What I like to do is I don't like quantity left. I want to say quantity available. 
okay? Otherwise, you're gonna have to always be updating that. And let's just make this like 25. Let's build some scarcity in there so people act fast. Speaking of acting fast, you can even put a timer in there. Let's click on the timer. Let's set this for, uh, we'll say the end of the month, July 31st, and we'll say, uh, what, 11 o'clock, all right, 59, and we'll make that a PM, right? I think we, it's an AM, PM there. Let's just do that, there we go. Select your time zone. Okay, there's my time zone right there, and we set it. Look, it's already, the timer's already going. Let's check it out again, we're updating it. All right, we're refreshing the screen. Oh my goodness, look at that. There's your, there look, does this look like a real deal? There it is, there's your timer and everything else. Now, the the vendor or the uh, the client, Little Louis, they wanna get paid, right? So the best way to do this, simplest way to do this is get a payment URL I say just use PayPal. PayPal makes it super, super simple, but you can use your merchant, you can get your stri use Stripe, anything you want, they will give you a payment URL. So you just click on this button right here, and in the button control, okay, this is where you're going to put the URL for the payment to go. So uh, again, I suggest PayPal. Go, go set up the deal in PayPal for them, get that button, and the best part about it is when it goes through, they'll be notified that a successful transaction went through, and then they can notify the customer and send them the deal. So it's that simple. All right, let's continue here. We're gonna customize this a little bit more. All right, um, there's another button that we could uh, uh, update right there. Again, we're not serving chicken here. Let's just change this. I'm gonna make a little bit more generic. Look at this, our background uh, image. We'll browse for images. And here, what we're gonna do, okay, wait, we're gonna click on this one here. And here what we're going to do is we're going to go to Pixabay and we're going to search for, I'm just going to say a restaurant. All right, I'm going to just try to find a good, good generic, there, I like this one right there. Good generic restaurant picture right here. We'll just do this one right here and we'll use that image. Oh, look how good that looks. Look, the text is black it, and it doesn't show up and I want to change that text anyways. I'm going to put this, I'm going to hang on. I typed it all out here. I can click on this, I could edit it. All right, we serve the freshest Vienna hot dogs and hand cut French fries in all of Chicago land. But you know what, black text isn't gonna work. Let's make that text white or gray, whatever that case is. And we're going to, of course, save the deal. Oh, we got it, we could, we could change the stuff at the bottom, put the little Louis in here, right? My images right there, all right. And we're gonna change that address. I'm not gonna do that right now, but you get the picture. Just change the address right there, change the phone number, the email address right there, and we are all set to go. By the way, if you don't want to use any anything on here, if you, if you wanna turn off any of the sections, look, you can turn off the header section, you can turn off the main section, you can turn off the service section, or the footer, or the copyright. It's all controllable right there. Speaking of controls, tracking codes. You can put Google Analytics in here, Facebook retargeting. You can put that all right in here. And how about optimizing for SEO? You can have your page title, you can have your metadata, your keywords, your description, all right there so you get found by uh, Google and all the search engines. That's it, everything is done. You could see this whole video, I've been talking now, it looks like about eight minutes, right? And at the time I've been explaining to you, I've also been building this, it means I could have built it out probably in three minutes. Update it one more time, and let's go ahead and refresh the page. There it is. There you go, there's, there's a demo of how fast it is to actually build this page in real time. Took me all of three minutes, right? So there you go, it's easy deals, I'm telling you, if you are a local marketing expert and you want to sell a hot product that local products want, they or local uh, customers want, they want a way to highlight their deals. They're tired of getting ripped up off by the group coupon type sites and stuff like that that take 75% of their profits. They, they want a reasonable price. They'll pay you a reasonable price because they've been paying out the nose to Groupon. You could charge them 100 bucks, 200 bucks, 500 bucks. It's gonna be a bargain to them. Plus, they're going to know it's a fixed cost. They don't like the unknowns. That's what the Groupon deal is. It's an unknown. You could charge a fixed price they will love you for it. I would probably set up a monthly deal. So you've got recurring income coming each and every month. This is why Easy Deals is such a great product. Hope you've enjoyed the demo. Jump on this, go ahead and grab it and add it uh, to your cart because this deal is not gonna be around for long. Enjoy.